The other top story at five, a Franklin man is charged with child abuse. Ten of your side did some digging and found he's a convicted sex offender out of Florida. Robert Lyons Jr. faces a list of charges, including prostitution of a minor. Investigators say they are looking for other potential victims. Ten of your side's Ava Hurdle is live in Franklin. So, Ava, what are police telling you? Well, police are not taking this allegation lightly, Nicole. In fact, investigators have turned up evidence to suggest there may be other child victims. Robert Lyons Jr. was arrested last week, initially based on a tip. On August 20th, uh, our investigators were approached by concerned parents, uh, which initiated an investigation to allegations of inappropriate conduct between an adult and a juvenile. Police then searched the Lion's Den barbershop, the business he owns and works in off South Street. Investigators also searched his home. It's based on what the detectives learned during the investigation and evidence obtained during the search warrants that would lead them to believe that there's the possibility that there may be additional victims. And because of that, Captain Witt has this advice for parents here. To talk to their children if they've had any contact with Mr. Lyons or have been known to frequent his business or his residence, parents need to talk to their children and find out if in fact they have been the victim of inappropriate conduct. He says this allegation is of great concern to police as an investigation continues. And anyone with information about this case is asked to call the Crime Line number. We're live in Franklin tonight. Ava Hurdle, 10 on your side. As we told you, we found Lines is a convicted sex offender in Florida. This is his mugshot from Duval County. That's near Jacksonville. He was charged in 1994 with lewd or lascivious acts against a child under 16 years old.